everybody, I am the Lazy Kiwi and welcome back to another Create a Sim video. Today, I haven't done the Breed Out the Weird challenge in quite a while, so I decided to do the Breed Out the Weird challenge again today. I have done this quite a few times on my channel, but I absolutely love the results most of the time, so we are going to be doing that again today. However... <laughs> Today my cast is a little bit broken because since I updated the game from the two new kits, uh, one of my mods just broke. I'm assuming it's one of the CAS mods, but I'm just gonna reinstall everything so that it's not broken anymore. But I can still very much do this challenge with it as it is, so just ignore some of the glitches. But I am just going to jump straight into this. I think first things first, I'm just gonna remove everything that he already has so that I do not confuse myself. And then I'm literally going to go through everything one by one. So the first thing I'm going to randomize is going to be skin tone, and I'm gonna randomize everything three times and now I'm gonna do everything for, for his face again everything is going to be randomized three times I'm kind of just hoping for some normal looking people because a lot of the times I get some really really strange fellas and I just don't know what to do with that <laughs> And three. Okay, so far it's not too bad. I'm not liking that his nose is so far away from his mouth, but there's nothing I can do at this point. Oh wow, he's really a looker, isn't he? I don't know how I feel about this. Um, so far I'm not in love. He's not really my type personally, but I feel like he could make some beautiful babies so it's it's not the end of the world he has a cute little button nose and everything but i i don't know how this is going to go i should also do his body one two and three. Oh, he's buff as heck now he <laughs> okay i think i clicked on absolutely everything on his face but it felt so fast so i don't know I'm just gonna continue on. I am going to set this to only be custom content though. I just feel like it's gonna be a lot more interesting if we do it that way. Oh goodness, he got a very normal shirt. Oh, I didn't do his hair or anything. <laughs> I was like, that felt super fast. Do you know why? Because I didn't even do his hair. That's, that's a me problem, oh my gosh. Anyway, one, two, and three three. Oh, you know what? That, that's not too bad. It really matches his sweater and kind of also matches his face. So I'm not too bad about that. But now for some pantaloonies. I really hope he doesn't just get underwear because that would be real sad. Okay, that was close to underwear, but luckily it is not. You know what? He's a really colorful guy. I'm happy with this so far. It's not too bad. It's really not the worst that I've gotten. So I'm pretty happy with how he's turning out. And three, he's a really colorful guy. I really don't hope that I missed anything. There might be a chance that I did. So if I did, do let me know in the comments down below, but I'm just gonna continue on. My guy's name is Alan Crow, and he has a real interesting personality. Yeah, he's jealous, evil, and a green fiend. Wow, what a guy. <laughs> okay, so this is our starting sim for the mom. Her name is Eliana William, and she also has a really interesting personality because it takes so freaking long. Okay, she's outgoing, loyal, and a geek. You know what? That is real cute. So I'm gonna start randomizing absolutely everything about Eliana over here and starting with a skin tone again. Oh my goodness, one, two, and three. Luckily, she is not gray. That would have been really interesting. Oh my goodness, <laughs> I'm so happy about that right now. But head shape, one, two, three. Okay, it does not look any different whatsoever. Eyebrows usually take a long time to generate, so we gotta give these a minute. And okay, there we go, some normal eyebrows. Eye shape. Okay, again, really normal. Nose shape, mouth shape. I really want to change the like cheeks and jaw because these are quite interesting at the moment. So one, two, three. Okay, that's a lot better, honestly. Her face is really indented, but right now she's looking real good. One, two, three. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's so cute actually i'm not i'm not mad about that that's actually really cute got the big ears okay so now for hair i'm not gonna forget about it this time she is going to have oh she's gonna show off them cute little ears oh my gosh two and three. Oh, that's actually cute oh my gosh she's looking she's actually adorable i actually like her <laughs> she's so cute oh i completely forgot to do her body shape so let me quickly go ahead and do that so we're gonna go one two and three. Oh my gosh she's so cute okay so this is what we are working with today we have our girl eliana and ellen over here and they are going to be making the baby so again just ignore the fact that it's real broken over here i'm gonna randomize a few times i'm not too sure how many times i want to randomize but i think maybe we go for three times so this is randomize number one randomize number two and randomize number three so this is the baby that we are going to be working with although she's not really a baby right now i probably should have turned her into an infant because now we're kind of getting a few spoilers but you know what that's okay i'm just gonna work with this usually when i have them in baby mode i do give them little makeovers but since i completely just neglected to do so i'm just gonna go ahead and turn her into a young adult or a teen first apparently okay well based off of her teen vibes and now young adult she's pretty oh my gosh she's actually really cute she's got her dad's button nose okay Guys, I'm really not mad about her. She's actually so cute. So, coming into this, we are just going to, again, take off everything that she currently has on. And then I'm going to start my makeover. But she is going to change a lot once I start adding skin details and stuff. It's kind of actually really crazy what skin details can do for your sims. Okay, so this is kind of what we are working with after the skin details. I am going to change her eyebrow color, so please don't hate me for that. But I kind of just want to go for some simple eyebrows. I actually really like these. They're very cute. And I'm going to go for a lighter shade because she does have blonde hair, I believe. So before I do the hair, I kind of want to do makeup first a lot of the times i really like to really see the makeup because some of the hairs do close it up quite a bit so oh my gosh it's so broken i really need to do something about this i'm gonna have to uninstall every single one of my mods okay so this is what i did for makeup i do think i'm going to give her custom eyes as well still brown i feel like the brown is really pretty but i do want to make it a little bit different also, just ignore the bells in the background. That is my cat apps going just crazy. <laughs> He's currently playing with one of his toys right next to where I'm recording. So if you do hear him, I'm so sorry about that. But I love how this is looking. Oh, I want to give her some eyelashes before we get into the hair. I have currently been obsessed with these eyelashes from Dream Girl. They are so pretty. I don't think they're for her in particular but they're so nice i absolutely love them i also really like these they are like completely different vibes but these also really nice i think they're from obscurus if i'm not mistaken yeah they definitely are okay you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna randomize her personality first and then i'm gonna kind of decorate her based off of what she has so she's vegetarian erratic and active oh my gosh okay so i'm gonna go for kind of like a sporty health aware crazy person then oh my gosh i actually really like this hair on her it's really like very big hair but i feel like it's so cute you know what that's really nice i actually love that so much it's so pretty and now for some clothes i am going to go for a top and bottoms because i feel like dresses could be a little bit too easy at times i'm thinking of kind of maybe going for a cute shirt like this one and then maybe putting a little undershirt underneath that yeah so kind of something like this i love how that is looking it's really cute and now for bottoms i'm not too sure what i want to do bottom wise i haven't thought about that at all oh i really like how this looks on her maybe in like a brown color oh that's really pretty i do like that a lot i think maybe we could get a few more accessories to go with this okay so after doing her clothes and adding in all of the accessories this is what we ended up with all we have to do is give her a name joanna 
and yeah that is everything she's looking so cute i could do all of her outfits but i feel like that's gonna take up way too much time i personally love how she turned out i love the outfit and everything about her she's absolutely pure perfection i did not see this coming when i was making her parents this could have gone much much differently so for a quick little reminder of what we started with, this is her dad. She could have been really buff, which nothing wrong with that. I just feel like the in-game buff bodies are a little bit weird, but that's just my personal opinion. And this is the mom that we were working with. Really cute face. I think she got a lot of her features from her mom, like the eyes maybe. And yeah, this is the result of those two people coming together. A really, really pretty little lady. She is so cute. I love her so much. Do let me know what you guys think about her and what you would have done differently for her little outfit. <gasps> I know what I could do differently. There we go. Now it's absolute pure perfection. I just gave her this cute dainty little necklace. Th that is everything that I wanted to do. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about her. And yeah, have a lovely day everybody. Thank you all so, so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, please do consider liking and subscribing to my channel. And I will definitely see you all in another video. Goodbye everybody.